Hello and welcome to GTM Hub. Today I'm going to show you our brand new feature, Key Results and Child Objective Calculation, which will enable you to take your OKRs to the next level. This new feature allows you to calculate the progress of an objective using both its key results and the progress of its child objectives. Let me show you how it works. First, we need to create an objective. As an example OKR, let's assume we want to expand our store presence across Europe. Now that we have our OKR set up, we can set up a few key results that will aid us towards reaching our objective. For example, we would like to increase our monthly recurring revenue to $7 million. In addition to this, we would probably need operating licenses for our business if we are to work across different countries. Let's assume we are aiming for an expansion across six different countries. Now that we have our key results in place, we are going to create child objectives that further work toward achieving our high-level goal. Let's set up two new child objectives, Head East and Head South. Each of these objectives will have its own respective key results. We can speed this part up and head straight towards demonstrating how our new feature works. Now that all the key results of the child objectives are in place, all that's left to do is to change the type of progress calculation of our main OKR. To do so, just click Edit on the objective and choose Progress Calculation to be Key Results and Child Objectives. Click Save and presto! The child objectives are now taken into account for the main OKR's progress. Simply refresh the page and you'll be able to see both the child objectives and the original key results we created under the main objective. Now that the setup is complete, updating a key result in a child objective will be reflected in the progress of the main OKR. With this new GTM Hub feature, your OKR management can be more flexible than ever. Thank you for watching.